My name is Jerome Derodi. I'm a clinical lecturer at the School of Pharmacy at Medway. Um, my speciality area, amongst others, is infections and antimicrobials. The role of a microbiologist is fairly wide-ranging, so it might involve purer research, such as looking as to how bacteria actually communicate with each other and that, how that's needed to form biofilms or layers because these can contaminate bits of equipment. On the other hand, it can be more applied and specific, like finding out which bacteria are resistant to which antibiotics and why that's the case. To be a good microbiologist, you need to develop fairly good lateral thinking skills because not everything is straight from the textbook and you obviously need to know an awful lot about the detail of the science behind it. So for example, if you want to be looking at the discovery or development of a new antimicrobial, there are various ways in which that might possibly happen. It could simply be a slight chemical variation on a structure that's already known. On the other hand, uh, it might be a question of collecting samples, such as soil samples, from all parts of the world um, and suddenly discovering that there's a chemical in one of them that actually has antimicrobial action. I started off with a straightforward undergraduate degree in microbiology, actually happened to be in microbiology and genetics, and then went on to do a master's with a research project in medical microbiology. In terms of training, it really depends where and how you're going to apply your microbiological knowledge. Anything from two to six years, I guess, depending as to the field and the speciality that you're working in. Microbiology has a real importance to everyday life, but it goes far wider than that in our modern world. A number of specialist industries depend on microbiology for their function. So, for example, the food and drinks industry, baking, cheese making, brewing even if you enjoy your alcohol, the water and waste industries. The fact that we have sewage treatment works is really important. Without microbiology, we'd simply be shunting raw sewage straight into our rivers and seas. And then, of course, nowadays, there are the biotechnology industries. They're really important. So biofuels, important to the modern world and our ecological balance, they depend on microbiology. Microbiology isn't just limited to health and disease, but actually touches every aspect of a modern society's everyday life. So as you can see, it's really important and really exciting.